Be back. I knew you'd gone off somewhere. What's your poison? Tequila old fat. Top it up with beef and sprinkle in some chip. Silverhead special. Wow, since anyone ordered that. On the menu? Information. Cassius Ryder. He's still breathing. Tattoo guy? I haven't seen him in a good long while. You have to check up on him yourself. Works in Watson down on Pershing. So what'll it be? Billy Goat? The other one. Other one. She's gonna love it. <laughs> sure she will. Jeremiah Crazy. Heard he's an operator for Smasher. But you didn't hear that from me. Hey, who are you again? Yeah. Could say we had something in common. <laughs> Ruby Collins. Sloppy second for Grayson. After I banged her. Something better. Hey, you Ruby? What? You've heard about me? Let's, Let's get out of here. Tell you what I heard. Then you'll show me if I'm right. 
Just got a little biz to take care of first. For me, let's go back to my place. Where to? Martin Street, but take the long way. Look good on you. Got a light? I'll call. I'll call. Ruby, focus. I need to talk to Grayson. First thing every morning. <sighs> Talk about something else, please. Sure. First time you walked up, since there was something familiar about you. Blah, blah, Johnny told you. Uh, did we... You know... No. Gonk was too drunk. He called me early morning. Of course... I thought it was you. And I thought, cute kid. Too bad she's gone completely whacked. <sighs> Came to see for yourself, huh? Morbid curiosity. Mm-hmm. And I found Johnny Silverhand. That feels weird, this. You knowing about Johnny? Face is changing, you know. Still look like V. But that mean smirk, I'd know it anywhere. How he talks, moves, how he smokes. I don't smoke. I know. Could never confuse you two. So sleep soundly. Smasher, he, he tell you about him? Yes. Didn't know he'd come back to NC. Johnny found some way to get at him. Wait, Grayson? Jeremiah Grayson. Works for Smasher. Johnny got a tip off some stripper, don't ask me how. Ebonike. Just that. Still, let me see what I can do. We're gonna get that son of a bitch. Know what Smasher's been up to all this time? Disappeared after the Sokka Tower assault in 2023. All thought he was gone for good. Then suddenly reappeared. Did a few Mondo jobs for Arasaka, then went right back to ground. Nobody's seen him in years. Except Grayson, apparently. Can I help at all? 
In your state? <laughs> You're useless. Almost. I'll buzz you when I learn something. Okay. Unbelievable that bastard's somewhere in your head. Never. Again. I had no idea the pills would lay you out like this. Maybe it wouldn't be bad if you hadn't chased them down with fuck knows what. You ought to be the one puking right now. Yeah, well, life ain't fair. Sure picked the right moment to bolt out of my body. Ought to be happy I left it all. I am. Look at me, spewing joy and rainbows. Like a fucking ray of sunshine. Well, we moving? The hell is this place? A place where you can puke all over the carpet, no problem. Beggar, not chooser. So, feeling better? No. to the bottom of Ebonica. Flicked pings to some contacts. Grayson buzzed familiar for a friend from the olden days. He did some digging. Found something. A section of the docks that's Maelstrom turf. So why are these docks called Ebonica? 
Pretty sure it's got nothing to do with some long dead mayor. Dead wrong, actually. It's not the docks. It's an old container ship named after the guy. So you found Grayson? You really got an in with Smasher? Come see me. Afterlife. We'll talk. Okay. Somehow always find a way. Let's go. Good luck. How did Wayland help you exactly? He made sure we'll find Grayson at home when we start off. So we know where to look for him. a little something. Try it on. Thanks. Johnny say about me? No, you two talk all the time. Said you're the best. Always were. The best? <laughs> Too bad that comes at a price. Sure you're up for this. What? You getting cold feet? No. Just... I want to see Johnny haze you. Adam Smasher's his obsession, not yours. <laughs> Think so? Just trying to play fair. Little weird you didn't run into Smasher before now. Came up in conversation, time to time. But, uh, never tried to track him down. Listen, V. The fact that Johnny's back changes things, okay? Okay, sure. Believe me, I'd know. We'll get back to that, I guess.
Okay, here's as far as we go. Might be our lucky day. Drop Grayson and Smasher in one go. Fucker's gotta be around here somewhere. So what's our plan? Wayland saw Grayson somewhere on the docks. He was with somebody. Smasher. So I hope. Gotta get to the Maelstrom data term first. Should be some info on Smasher there. Main stash house. Data terms there. Know where their data term is? How, exactly? Set up the buy myself. Athena D3, external database. Okay, we can start. Too many rats around. Better wait till a little darkness creeps in. And in the meantime, we do what? Wait and watch. <laughs> Okay, good as it's gonna get. Maelstrom's got the docks covered, and you'll cover me. Come on, let's go. She's tense. No cover her just in case. Scan it, see if there's anything we can use. I'll watch the door. Now it knows exactly where to find it. She's stalling. Told you, Rogue's still scared of the asshole. It's like they're hiding out on the ship. Okay, let's see what we turn up. Over there, to the right.
There she is. The Ebony King. <laughs> Not looking so hot. Even shittier on the inside. Let's go. Why are you even doing this? I'm settling a score. Avenging Johnny? That too. Smasher. Could crack your skull like an eggshell. Know that? You'd still be able to talk. For a little while. But I'm happy to talk. Ever wonder how Rogue survived after the attack on the tower? How in hell no one ever hunted her down? Her alone. <clears throat> Out of all that Atlantis trash. Cause I do. I truly wonder how far she had to go to set herself up so comfy. Who'd she finger fuck? Whose crack did she have to lick to... What's he going on about? He's trying to throw you off. Gonk thinks he can still squirm out of this. Where's Smasher now? <clears throat> With the Arasakas. But I think you know that already. When's he due back? Never. Faithful old Adam's just been named the head of security there. <clears throat> Not coming back to this rat hole ever. I stayed behind just to tie off his loose ends. Shit! Could say that again. You two will never jump that high. Smasher's out of your reach. But don't feel bad. He'll find you himself to resolve shit like this in person. Gonna lead us to Smasher, Assface. Even if I wanted to, he don't trust me enough to... Hey, why are you so interested in Smasher anyway? Not interested in Silverhand. And what happened to him? <laughs> Johnny Silverhand? What do you want to know? Silverhand's iron. You had it. What? You a fan, too? Smasher give it to you? Uh-huh. Reward for a special job well done. Smasher ever tell you what he did with Silverhand's body? That into him, huh? Plan to exhume that scop? Or you just want to hear how he died, soaked in his own Neuron scorched by Soul Killer. What did they do with him? Badlands, near the oil fields. Buried out there. <laughs> 101 northbound. Then head for the landfill. Dig deep enough. Might even find a shit smeared. Heard so enough. Far. Finish him. Let's fuck her. quickly. Wanna rip my eyes out just looking at him. No, no, wait. I got something. Silverhand. You're into him, right? Could give you something.
You got lucky today. Turning soft on me, V. What I promised. In the container. On that Goliath over there. What's inside? You'll see. Got the access cart right here. Take it. For fuck's sake. Thing. Still no leads, nowhere to go from here. Fuck. V, tell her. To Johnny, You're wasting more my time. Old grudge. Really? Like, what is it? It's about you. He wanted to do this with you. What, to cheer me up? <laughs> Didn't work. Smasher. Fuck! You don't get it. This isn't about Smasher. He's just the goddamn tip of the iceberg. Even if we get him, what does that get us? No reason to stay. I'm out. Not at all curious. Let's get... Leave her, Leave her alone, V. She'll get it together. But times like this, she prefers to be alone. Okay. I get that. Gotta get that container down somehow. If there's something of mine in there, I want it back. Okay. Looking for the control panel. There it is. I know what it is. Let's see what we got here. Take that rag off it. Okay. My ride. Hop in. I'll even let you drive. Hers like a dream. Oh, yeah. All right. Let's go see where they fucking planted my ass. Never realized the thing between me and the road was that serious. Ah, oh, damn right it was serious. When we met up, someone always died. How so very romantic. Definitely your style. There was always something going on. She had a gig, I had a gig. Music was never run of the mill. Although did try to take her to see a flick once. And and nothing came of it, as usual. Not far now. Huh. Worse than I thought. Gotta be around here somewhere. Can't believe they bothered to truck it all the way out here. Ah, uh, better than the junkyard where I landed. So that's how it is. Nothing here at all. Headstone, flag, and flowers. No, I, I don't know. A marker, something, anything. Really need symbolic empty gestures. Guess I do. Thought I'd feel like I'd closed a chapter here. Like I'd said goodbye to the old silver hand. Hello to the new. And how do you feel? Like I never even was. More like I was still inside the Koshi. We'll figure something out.
Let's say it was my real grave. What would you write? Here lies Johnny Silverhand. who saved my life. V, you don't know how much I want that to be true. Listen, I realize I fucked up a lot of things. Either let down or used every last person who gave me their trust. Blind, selfish bastard that I was. But I've managed one thing for now. Not to fuck this up. What we have. Been a long bumpy road, but we made it. Most people I thought were my friends. They couldn't even stand to be in the same room with me. You're fucking closest to me by a long shot. There, 24-7. And yet, you don't seem to hate my living guts. You were a real dick wipe at first. You sort of deserved it. Remember waking up at Victor's not knowing about me? I'm seeing things, I'm scared. Then moaning at Misty's about how you didn't want to die. Remember you whining for smokes in the middle of the night, complaining about not being able to kill me. Never thought we'd make it this far. When you said you let your friends down, did you mean Rogue? Rogue, Alt, Carrie, Santiago. Not all is lost yet. At least with Rogue. Can't pretend nothing's changed over 50 years. Can't just insert myself into her life. Come on. Already have. True that. You know, did promise her I'd take her to the movies long, long ago. Good idea. Call her for me. Ask if she's free some night. Thing is, you'd have to surrender control... again. Yeah. I'll call her. Okay. That's Delta. Nothing to see here after all. Worth coming out all the same. Absolutely. Thanks, V. Of all the heads I could have popped up in, hella glad it was yours. Johnny wants to ask you out on a date. What do you think? Johnny's asking? Or is it you? Johnny? You're the one who said you got no trouble telling us apart. Okay. And where to go? Where'd you want to go? Silver Pixel Cloud in North Oak. Okay. 
I'll swing by the afterlife. Pick you up. Some crew taking you along as bait? That a compliment? You look... different. <laughs> Try again. Maybe you'll find some charm the third time around. Hey, Rogue. Ready? Again, you. We going? Where's Johnny? Couldn't make it after all? You look... That Johnny's well, or yours? When's he gonna show? I'm just your driver. See, you keep him on a short leash. <laughs> Wise beyond your years. This Johnny's Porsche? <laughs> Where'd you get it? That's what was in the container. The one Grayson was talking about. Hmm. Okay. Got a lot of memories in this car. Let's go. Silver Pixel Cloud, your favorite place? Once, probably. Haven't been there in ages. Drive-ins went out of style a century ago. But Silver Pixel's still hanging in there. Sounds like a cream place for a day. Thought so, too. Which is why I suggested Johnny take me there a million years ago. So it wasn't his idea. Of course not. His idea of a romantic night out was blowing up our Osaka HQ. All right, V. Tell me what's going on. For real. Meaning... Johnny doesn't do a thing without an ulterior motive. So what's in play this time? Johnny's changed. He really does want to spend some time with you. No hooks, no lines, no sinkers. Right. Rogue? Just taking it all in. <laughs> A selfless Johnny Silverhand. Apparently you're a positive influence on him. Here we are. Fuck. I don't believe it. It really has been years. Managed to shut the whole thing down. V, try to get inside. Can't stop us, won't stop us. We asked you out on a date. All right. Do your thing. I'll watch. Okay. Gotta be the past, this. Guess we really are going to the movies. Wham bam sha la la. All right, let's go. Well done. Try and get the projector started. I'll get us some seats. Sure thing. 
Right, let's go check the projector. Entrance is over here. Oh, interesting. Okay, looks like I found the projector. You wouldn't happen to know how to get it up and run. Glad to see. Look at that. Last played Bushido 10. Perfect. Looks like a spurt of runny shit. V, we're at a drive in. Movie's the last thing we care about. Just want some background noise, a little blood, tits, and gore, that sort of thing. Bushido will give you that. All right, V, run along. I'll take it from here. Have fun, you crazy kids. Grabbed us the best spots. Hop on up. Things would have to change for us to just go out and catch a movie. Never imagined they'd change this much. Let's pretend it's 2015, huh? We just met, and I got no idea what a bastard you are. Sure, lured you to the movies so we could bang, by the way. <laughs> it's technically a possibility. Okay, so it's 2015. If you could do it all again, what would you change? Anything at all? I do everything in my power not to lose you. Johnny, I... Hey, hey, hey. What's this? Nothing, it's just... I had a lot of time to think while you were away. What ifs and all that. Sure, that's it. Nothing about Grayson or Smasher. What? What's Smasher got to do with anything? Get the sense you still got a thorn in your side there. Cause I do. I'm irate, disappointed, but rather not think about it now. All that counts is I'm back, with you. Think that's way better than any what if. But all we got's this one night. It's more than I ever could have asked for. Rogue, I'm here on borrowed time in a borrowed body. But I'm here.
Johnny, I can't. It's not right. No, you don't. Tried so hard to pretend nothing's changed. To pretend I'm the same rogue you knew. Actually managed to fool myself a little. Get back on my own. Rogue! Fuck. Rogue's gone. Yep. Guess things did not go swimmingly. Nope. Was gonna be a nice night at the drive-in. Now she's mad and won't tell me what about. Any guesses? Remember Grayson? How they spoke? How weird it was? Weird's not the word, I don't think. He was toying with her. Could be something to that. Gotta mull it over. For now, take me to North Oak. That's supposed to help you figure out Rogue? No. Carrie. Tell you once we're there. Movie was a turd wrapped in crepe paper. this at all this porcelain bitch is the worst kind of news I know I'll be careful not exactly one of your strong suits listen first sign of trouble be Delta Hanako-sama <laughs> Did the place? Shit. Excellent. You have come. Let's step to it then. Before we discuss details, I feel I weren't sure of anything. If you could trust me, if your no boot killed your father, no. I knew. From the start. You knew? All the board members knew. Not one soul even slightly interested in the matter believed in the poisoning. Details were disparate, inconsistent. You knew, but didn't do a thing about it? Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is?
You were gonna talk biz? Specifics? Let us do so. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Take me for a fool. Think I'd fall for that? Got plans to walk out of here alive. Had I any ill intentions, I would have chosen a side far more discreet than this. We are here because I know how to save your life. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Minen, Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Want to leave? What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is going to be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. And you'll help me in exchange for... My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility. Just say it. Be easier that way. I want him punished. Still vague. You want him dead. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu. Hanako-sama. Soro-soro go-jitaku ni omodori itaraite. Sugu ni sumu wa. Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you will testify against my brother. Testify? Listen, mind if I'm stray with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Offers intriguing. Need to think about it. And I will need to return to this. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. Let's fly the fuck out of here. V, do you feel all right? Huh? You are bleeding. Fuck. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make no your decision. Worries about that. You could use some air right now. <coughs> I warned you. What, what are you doing? Stand on your own two feet. While I'm good to go, body listens to me. See what I'm getting at? Of course I can see. Want me to hand over the keys? I want to save your life. Pop some pseudo endotrizy, scooch, and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Mikoshi. Uh-huh. Oh, exactly. Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she'd have stuck her neck out for you a half a century ago. But now, I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find the way inside Mikoshi. It's our only chance. What about Pan Am? She offered help. Listen up, V. Those guys are trailer tuggers. 
An assault on Arasaka is just not another convoy to Jack. You already tried this with amateurs. Both know how that ended. And you tried it with pros. Didn't end any fucking better. You don't want those people involved. Their lives on the line, possibly on your conscience. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. Hanako's offers on the table. I'm sorry. Whose? Oh, God, the crap. She actually has power. Could be our ticket. Yeah, one-way ticket to the city morgue. That suck a cunt scrambled your circuits. Rogue and I will handle this, just like we used to. Rogue? I don't know. You honestly think it could work? With her experience, her resources, her connections. Won't find anyone better in MC. Johnny. It's gotta work. We breach the tower. All cracks open Makoshi. Then I fuck up that. Great, you checking out again? Sensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Uh. Almost done. Stabilizing the biochip. No, feels like. Someone's using your head as a knife block. How? How did I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Then, you shoved my patient at the time off the table, and demanded you be treated immediately. Talman was your guardian angel. Huh? I, uh... I wasn't completely myself. I know. And that's a bit worrying. Order a week or poison next time. This ain't no joke, kid. As I see it, there won't be a next time. All right, that should be a little better. Try sitting up carefully. I'll try. Think I'm getting some feeling back. <sighs> so slowly. Another victory for the history books. Well, looks like I can sit up, all right. But I can tell you don't have good news. How much longer is this going to go on? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Next attack, you will be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Take matters into my own hands. The fuck you think I've been doing? Well, whatever it is, it keeps landing you on my table. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah? What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo-endotrys in there gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. 
Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you, and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endo Trizine, Rogue, Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Enough, Johnny. I just... I gotta think about it. Need to stretch your noodle? Fine. Fine. Not it's not in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Uh, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. I think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here. Thanks, Vic. Oh well. And you hang in there too. Good luck, kid. Hey, V. I heard. Well, your thoughts. Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on, and I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. His chakras are all blocked up today. Plus, he's had too much coffee. Let me guess. My aura's sputtering? Mm-hmm. Afraid so. Sure. Lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What, what's he got to do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. Same glum face. Who, oh, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumbas on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie. He found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. Ah, oh, that's more like it. Air. See that? I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Be alone with my thoughts. You're on unachievable these days. So what? What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, you know. I'm gonna be a legend in this city. I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, I'm still here. For now. You know, you should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. 
if things don't go our way. Just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. Judy. Yeah, even I've grown to like her. She ought to know that. Hey, Judy. Oh, hey, V. What's cracking? Time we, uh, avoid this woman. Hmm? A lot of fun, wasn't it? What you said then, about what you sensed in me. Death. Wish it had been anything else. Something nice. Hey, not like it was your fault. Here's hoping it comes out better next time. Listen, whatever it is you're gonna try, just be careful, okay? I'm here waiting. Thanks. Do my best. <sighs> okay. Was good you called. Wish I'd had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Just think, it all started in a fucking landfill. <laughs> Man, you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that, or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats, but then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then. You'll have your own soul on your conscience. Think you ought to go with Rogue. Two of you together got the best shot. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. You're up, Johnny. I trust you. Take the wheel. Just go easy on us, yeah? Thanks, V. I'll get us through this. You'll see. See you on the other side. Even if I gotta burn this whole fucking city Look down. Look who we have. I'll put you doing? this way, Wakako. Don't get in my way. You're running your little operation only because I have allowed it. And I can change my mind whenever I want. Hang on, give me a sec. V? Try again, Rogue. Got one more guess. Johnny. We'll talk soon, Wakako. What do you want, Johnny? Jesus, who died? Not happy to see me? Frankly, I'm not sure. Why? We had fun at the movies, didn't we? We're not at the movies anymore. Plus, got a good idea why you're here. You want something. And that's always a bad sign. Of course I do. And who better could I take it to? Out of that whole crazy crew from Atlantis, by some crazy coincidence, only you survived. The hell's that supposed to mean? Just thinking back. You miss the old times at all, Rogue? Fine with where they are, fine with where I am. I can see that. Shame no one else from the Atlantis had the same luck. Your shift's done. You're heading home to kick your feet up. Okay. Guess I'm gonna go back to work. 
We'll have the whole place to ourselves. Hmm. VIP treatment. Now talk. Just what the hell are you insinuating? That my bottle behind the bar? Yep. Been waiting there. Just... I never knew what the fuck for. But I'm starting to get some good ideas about how I might use it. Shows a cozy life for yourself. I'm just curious what it cost you. We all pay a price for the choices we make. I'm no exception. That what you tell yourself when you're cashing corp checks? That's what I tell myself when I stand over the graves of the crew from the Atlantis. It's what I tell myself when I look at you now. Oh, hey. The past is the past. That's right. But that's not why you're here. You want to drag me into something again, and this chatter is just a prelude. This body, I'm trying to... I... no. Fuck! V's dying, and I'm the fucking cancer killing her. But the process can be stopped. I just have to... Johnny, don't start. Don't tell yourself you're out to help someone. It's only ever about you, so you can feel better. Now fuck off, princess. I'm running out of time. When that fucking clock strikes 12, Johnny will disappear and V will go with him. Need to get myself out of her head before that happens. We managed to contact Alt. She agreed to help. But? Only one place we can do it. The data fort. Mikoshi. And the only access point we got a chance of reaching is tucked snugly under Sokka Tower. Arasaka? Again? Should have seen that coming. Only an idiot does the same thing over and over, while expecting things to work out differently. You even have a plan for this? Oh Christ, see that's what's wrong with kids these days. Everybody's always asking about some fucking plan. It ever been different? Back in the day, you snorted some lines, grabbed your iron, and did what needed doing. And that's why it worked. And it'll work for us now. Hang on. Us? Willing to miss out on this? So, what? I dust off and load up my tsunami? Rejoin your crusade against Arasaka? Bingo. When? Dunno. Now? Hmm. And what makes you think I'd agree? Owe it to yourself. Is that so? Sure, you can just be the queen of the ball in Night City. But that's not the real road. The real rogue you buried while you climbed to the top. Look deep. I know you can find her again. Shit. Knew this would happen one day. That one night, by some fucking miracle, you waltz in here and tear everything down. Some things never change. And us? Have we changed? I don't know. Well, what do you say we go find out? Will you lend me a hand? Shut the fuck up, Johnny. Just stop talking.
fucking Christ! <laughs> Every time. Every time. Never have I seen one not drunk as a pig sleep over 20 hours. Next time, time you're, you're losing teeth. Think so? I would like to see you try. But the boss would not be happy when I break your bones. Mean rogue? There's only one boss. Let's go. The boss awaits. You said your hellos. Excellent. Rogue, what's this specimen doing here? He's our pilot and our ride to Corpo Plaza today. Rogue. You are the best. Of course I am. Your sorry ass wouldn't be here otherwise. Gears over there. Help yourself. Don't mind if I do. Retro thrusters, anti graves. Strap them to your legs, and you can jump from damn near any height. I'm not your fucking babysitter. Never mind. Got it. Okay, now. Gonna tell me what the plan is? Yep. Jack in the shard. Targets the Makoshi access point in Arasaka Tower. Need to reach the lab. Hold it just long enough to do what we need to do, then get out alive. Arasaka Tower's a fortress, the most secure building in Night City. Walking in through the front door just ain't an option. So, we'll get in through a window of our own making. Specifically, we fly in on the Militech Strix tactical bomber. First, we rain fire on the building's air defenses from a high altitude. Then we breach a wall on the 76th floor, jump from the AV, and survive the landing thanks to our anti-grabs. That's right. We'll land smack in the middle of a tropical rainforest. Contrary to popular opinion, Arasaka has panache at times. We cut our way through the jungle to a shaft located on the tower's vertical axis. The shaft runs the height of the building. We use our retro thrusts again. Reach the bottom floor quickly. We'll surprise the socks off security. They'll be in disarray. Resistance should be minimal. We hit the lab floor running, reach the access point. The rest will be in your hands. I'll hold for applause. As I said, there's only one boss, one queen. Sheesh, didn't say you had a bomber. We all have our secrets. Guess nowadays a slick red Mezutani just doesn't cut it. How'd you get that? I'm the best fixer in town, idiot. Enough said. Now focus on the plan. Saying we're gonna rain fire on these assholes. Seriously? I've waited too long for this. Don't bust out of your pants just yet. If we want to survive, we gotta do a lot more. Here comes the tricky bit. We're gonna knock a Jerujan 0401 Comsat off its orbit. Blood clot satellite. We gonna make history, friends. That'll freeze comms in NC, NorCal, and SoCal. Should buy us three or four hours. No coordination, no support, complete chaos. I'm not even gonna ask how. Got a certain acquaintance at Orbital Air. History benefactor? Highly positioned informant. I'll pay him enough to give us access to the Jerujan. The rest will be up to our old net runner friend. Amy Hall. Only one I know who can rip an Arasaka satellite out of the sky. Brew all 
this up while I was asleep? Actually, I brewed it up while you were dead. A finger in the comms network pie when corp conflicts start to heat up again could be worth gold. Because nothing stands to make you more at ease than war. I'm supposed to talk to Alt anyway. I'll convince her. Don't fuck this up, Johnny. It's the one thing I can't do for Said I'd do it, and I will. So summing up, we fly to Arasaka Tower unnoticed and say hello with a welcome basket of misfits. Exactly. Then we jump in, find the building's vertical axis, and work our way down. To the Makoshi access point. Yeah. What'd you think? See, just one problem. There's no coming back from this. You'll burn bridges. To ash and dust. All Arasaka's gonna be gunning for you. Yeah. Probably Orbital Air will, too. But as I see it, they braided this whip that's gonna sting them. So, what do you think? Plan's got more gaping holes than a Kabuki dollhouse. But fuck it, it's gotta work. It won't be the stupidest stunt we've ever pulled. Rogue? What? Just, thank you. Thank me later. There's still the matter of all. Do you know how to move around cyberspace? Well, V got some practice under her belt. Sure, I'll manage. Head out back. Nix will show you the ropes. And you, Wayland, heat up the streets. We'll be with you soon. How long you gonna be? Might I have time for a nap? <laughs> hey. So you the one gonna die, right? That is the plan. Right on. Hop into a suit. And have a seat over there. I'm finishing up for the day. So you be resurfacing on your own. And don't fuck with my gear. believe that. Some of her is still in there. Hell, you look just like her. You see Alt because you wish to. It's a defense mechanism. Your explicit memory is simply creating a replacement image. It's weird. Like Having I... a bad dream. You read my thoughts? An oversimplification. You still deny what you are. A construct. A set of data. I... know you. You... know me. Like lines of code. So why even bother talking if you know my thoughts? As action precedes reaction, so Johnny Silverhand speaks before he thinks. Huh. That's some kind of joke? Only a... Sliver of memory from Alt's sense of humor. So, what else do you know? The complexity of your emotions. Time is short. Netwatch could detect our local net traffic. I know how we get to. It's beneath Arasaka Tower. Predictable. Holy fuck, you're doing it now. You're reading my... Your engine 0401 poses no problem. I can deactivate the satellite. C -c can you just hold on a second? You will breach Arasaka Tower and locate the port into Mikoshi. This is the program that will establish the link. I will send it with you on a splinter. Upon your opening of a back door, I will be able to circumvent the data fort's security protocols. And then? You will be separated from V. 
and Mikoshi will cease to exist. No fear. I mean, something could go wrong. Fear is the wrong word. Serious shop talk now, Alt. This is a jailbreak for the others, right? The little souls will fly free. Yes. Not good enough. I know there's more to it. Just spill it. They will become part of something greater. Nope. Keep trying. Don't understand. Because it is not something you can understand. Fine. Have it your way. Is that everything? Well, wait. Just one other thing. I have no more time for you. Look at us. I'm a digital corpse, and you're a... Well, you are what you are. Yes. Hmm. No, guess we don't have anything to talk about, do we? Well, see you in Mikoshi? Yes. reason to worry. Now, pull over. Kill the engine and have a nice long look at the stars. Simply that. You won't regret it. Gotta go. I love you. Ready? Rogue, who is that? My son. Wasn't expecting that. You telling me you, uh, you got a, uh... Private life. Yeah. And we'll leave it at that. Asked if everything's ready. Yeah, it's ready. Good. Now come on, or that lunatic will take off without us. I like this joint. Gonna miss it. the very top. So, Waylon, what'd you tell him about the job, exactly? Only what he wanted to know. His cut. Which while we're on it, how much for a job like this? That's between him and me. You really that big a deal? Fixer Merc confidentiality. Got my rules. Deal with it. What a 
that be? Take a look. See that? One day you're in the gutter, the next, you got the whole city at your feet. The whole fucking city, where no one can make you do shit. Not even those motherfuckers. No idea how this is gonna end, but let me tell you, it'll be one loud morning. Time we gave this city another wake-up call. Jesus, it's so beautiful. About to get even prettier, too. The hell you say? You two take a pop at your chair? <laughs> I wish, Squama. Eyes on the sky, everybody. Coming to make some entrance. Wayland never jumped. Crashed by the waterfall. I'll try to re-establish contact with him, then find someone who's got access for the elevator going down. Wayland, you read me? How many pieces you in? Still one, I owe. And I think the local tribe's taken an interest in me. We'll get you out of there. Don't move. As if I could. We're going after Wayland. Got it. Guards. Occupied at the turn. Slip and buy is an option, and so is taken out. I'll follow you. All units support! Opening fire! We can't use this term somehow. Okay, to the bird. I reached Wayland. Head for the waterfall. Waiting for you there. Let's get to work. Hey, Wayland, you hear me? Loud and clear. Doors all what? night. See that one? A high ranker, holding the access we need. All yours, Johnny. Oh, oh, Murphy left to say. Look what the cat dragged in. Let's grab the access token and make for the elevator. Go! 
Always, officers. Just like back then. Remember. Of course I do. You're still the best. Chase, chase. 
open it from here. Probably a control term nearby. Open. Patching in all. Let your woman out of her box. Let her show us what she's got. Hey, you've always been the one. Know that, right? I do. Just a shame you never did. Well, could have been worse. Alt's in. Think she can break through the ice? I have bypassed security. I have complete control of the building. The way from the Kushi is clear. Elevator, now. Netrun Operations Control. 2067. An Arasaka bodyguard shields the Emperor of Japan from an assassin's bullet. 2071. Arasaka security forces prevent mass riots in San Francisco, saving the world. 2074. Bullshit. Know that look? Got something on your mind? Never think back about why we did it. Did what? Why we took on the corpse, strapped in leather, chrome, and iron. Don't know, Johnny. We were young. Hot blood in our veins, shit judgment in our heads, like all pups. We fought for beauty, not knowing what was good or true. It was only the beautiful that meant a damn thing to us. Don't let your mind wander. We'll kick around old brain cells over vodka once we're done. My treat, eh? Poor people with stories of the old and days. Just like my grandparents. Yes. Arisaka Netrunners have stormed the tower's systems. Stopping their advance is my priority. Continue on your way alone. I've cleared a path, but you must hurry. I mean, I'm for Wound up turret fox. Holy fucking crap. Oh, shit. Seems Cunningham's made strikes these last decades. Stood a chance. Come on, the way down's beyond the door. I'm preparing to repel a netlinger attack originating from outside the facility. You will be on your own now. And you must hurry. An Arasaka elite force isn't far behind. Let's move it. Okay, so close, I can almost smell the data stream. Room past the partition. We cross that door. I turn back time, Johnny. Ever. But you can always start. Oh! 
Son of a bitch. You made more, more than you or I ever could. Best, Best there ever was. was. And you killed her. She knew the risks. Rogue had it in for you. Finally got what she wanted. You're talking tribe. I killed the old cunt. Don't know shit, Smasher. She finished things off on her own terms. Something you'll never get.
Once out of nature, I shall never take my bodily form from any natural thing. But such a form as Grecian goldsmiths make, of hammered gold and gold enameling, to keep a drowsy emperor awake, or set upon a golden bough to sing to lords and ladies of Byzantium of what is past or passing or to come. Looks like I was right again. Told you I'd handle it. Good to see you too, Johnny. You see any of what went down? No, but that's probably for the best. Rogue's dead. Smasher was there. I'm sorry. Shouldn't be. Died for me, not for you. Is my body still in one piece? Parked it in Arasaka Tower's basement, plugged it into the network. I figured as much. Your output's been torching my brain with Soul Killer for a good while now. You'll be all right. I mean, look, you made it this far. Awareness of what's happening right now? That just <laughs> raunches. Alt neatly packed me into an engram. Couldn't even tell when. Or how. So what do you think? Like being a clump of ones and zeros? At first, the phantom pain. Jesus. I felt like my whole body was on fire. I realize now, it's not pain at all, just some digital simulacrum. Guess Alt's gonna start moving this digital psyche I am back into my flesh, but... I had no idea if I'll survive, or what I'll be if I do. Soul killer, we can't feel it doing its thing. How come? Should be pissing our panties in pain right now. Digital analgesia. Or data streams. Certain sensation inputs can be blocked, blah blah, yeah. Alt make you suffer through an exhaustive lecture? Imparted it instantly. Whatever. She did say she'd destroy Mikoshi. Just as you agreed. Gonna release all those poor bastards only to suck them into her own bosom. Make them part of herself. So we at the finish line? It's all in Alt's hands now? No. What the hell? Alt? I made a mistake in excluding the body as a factor. DNA reconfiguration has progressed too far. Added to aggressive, invasive medications, the body's immune system attacking its own neurons. Spit it out! In human terms! V will die independent of what I do. This is inevitable. This is imminent. For fuck's sake, Old. You had one job and you fucked it up? I could not know the situation before conducting a thorough and precise diagnosis. You promised this poor little shit a new life, and you lie. You fucking lie! Shut up for two seconds, will ya? Gotta think. You're gonna be alright. Think I of said, something. Give me one fucking minute. Old, come on. There's got to be a way out of this. The biochip has irreversibly changed the host organism. It no longer belongs to V, who is an intruder there. The situation is different for you. I'll 
changes were made to accommodate you. Tell your ex to kick me out of my own body. The changes are irreversible. You have nothing left to lose. He has everything to gain. I will not interfere in your personal affairs, but while Johnny has full control, he can do what he wishes. Give us what the hell for? So you could trick me into agreeing. Giving you a free pass, even though you can already do what you want with my body. Know what? I couldn't give a pig's prick what you think. I stay, you fuck off, that's the deal. You lying sack of shit. What do I do, Alt? Simply enter the well. V's body will be yours. While V will become a part of me. You lied to me from the start. Are you fucking kidding me? Options, you two-faced sack of shit! You're out, I'm in! That was the deal! Okay, easy. Ain't too big a dose of silver hand wound up in my blood. Need to chill. If I had to choose who to hole up with on a desert island, it wouldn't be you. Ever. No. The whole cast of little big corpo rats would have you be. Because you're a dickhead, in a big way. And sure, plenty of others out there are more deserving of life. <sighs> Even so, I never wish you would. I really think anyone gives a rat's dick how you look. Stop talking to you, V. Not much, but I'm all right with that. Best not leave this lying around.
got a bit of time, I think I'll manage to swing by and visit you two. Gonna need a ride. Steve. Gotta talk to Steve. Richard Knight, I built this fucking city. Open up. Hey. Hey, guy. What's up, Chum? Because I got that new album from Curse These Metal Hands. First four tracks? Preen, G. Bet you didn't get that shiner all by yourself. Um. Oh, man. Yeah. Forgot to wake him up. It was late getting to work. I mean, I guess I kind of deserved it. Grab my alarm clock later. Door's open. You're not gonna need it? Can't stand that fucking thing. Need wheels and a good driver for the day. Couple things in town I gotta take care of. No problem. I'll take you. My mom wakes out when I don't tell her I'm leaving. But it's not like she can hear me when I try to warn her. You ready? Hey, so when I play a lot, my fingers hurt. What do I do to stop them? You don't. Metal strings cut into your fingertips make them sore. Just how it is. Oh. Don't worry. Play long enough and you'll get calluses. Start hitting What do you think you're doing, you little shit? Going out. Where? Uh, just out for a sec. Be back soon. Back inside, now! I'm not about to let you go out, do who knows what, do you hear? Like Fuck's that. sake, you swipe my keys again? Inside. Now, you shit. What the fuck you want? Get you. Leave him alone and watch that tone. Get the fuck out of my face. Think I'm scared? You're another bum like the rest of us. Wanna try me? Go ahead. I don't have time for this shit. <sighs> Who the fuck knows? Another tramp, all of the same Oh, age. man. Probably he was shaking like you were gonna wipe him. Sorry. Shaking in our shorts. Ha! You kidding? My I... Started talking to I wish something bad had happened to him. Hop in. Day. Drop on myself. Want to be strong like you. You will be down the line. Though, sure hope you'll see he's not worth any skin off your knuckles. How come? Because you'll realize how weak he is, and it'll hurt. Where to? Time machine. Nice! Saw Carrie Yura down there once. You a fan? Of the legend? Of course I am. Why? Aren't you? Let's just say I'm not as big as fan. How come? Always seemed hung up on money, fame, other stuff. Never giving enough love to the music. If he did that, he'd be less than more soul. Could really be somebody. God. Makes it sound like you know him. As I do. I'm gonna be a musician someday too. Don't forget, it's not the easiest gig. Yeah, yeah, I know. Gotta work hard, practice. Still, sure. But it only gets harder after that. The critics, the haters, non-stop pressure. That shit crazy lifestyle. It can chew you up. Gotta start scribing songs then. You'll get good with practice, like anything else worth doing. Sooner you start, the better. 
got a few tunes in my head already. Cream. Lyrics don't come easy, though. I come up with anything. Seems like it's already been done, or it just sounds stupid. I kind of don't really know what to write about. What can I do for you? I saw you, my life was missing. Heard Gary Yerudan pops by once in a while. Probably not music story in life, see. Everybody pops by, at least. No way I'll pick on. Got a feeling I'm about to find out. I don't snoop on customers. I don't keep no record. And I don't run my mind. So, how can I help you? Looking for a six string electric. Feast your eyes. And in the end, just pay the cost. I I want something solid and true. What? And they're not? Most important things, the pickups. The toy's gotta have something decent. Don't give half a fuck how it looks. Okay. Cheap clunkers made out of shit plywood that itself is made out of unseasoned veneers. Seems playable. Just gotta know how. Rattle on the low E, cause the next boat. Nothing a screwdriver won't fix. No offense, but I'm looking for a real instrument. And willing to pay real money. Ah, you have said so. Come on, let's go out back. I'm coming too. Sure, you might learn something. Oh, come on, chill. How's this? Whoa! To the right awesome. and left, the latest chromatics and Henderson. Vintage axes in the back. Deleuze Orphean. Not a fake. Take a good look. Relax, just making sure. Looks authentic, well maintained. Must be around shit, 70? 90 and still going strong. Fretboard's pure organic ebony. Tensor Paradise. This a replica? Realist you or me? Gotta be over a hundred years old. Double humbucker, neck screwed in, not glued. A beauty. Classic. Perfectly balanced, too. Barely needs holding. May I? Of course. Let's run away. Best day ever. I'ma let you two play around in here alone. Else those savages out front will clean out half the city. Now 
never ever heard anyone play Silverhand like that. You know, I read he never took any lessons. Chum was totally self-taught, made up his own style. How do you do that? I mean, sound just like him. Practice every day and you'll play like that, maybe better. You can learn anything, I promise. Uh, I don't know. I can learn a few riffs by heart, but it'll only ever be performing, never next gen. Good point. That's why it's better to invent your own jam. That's what practice is for. And talent. Talent you got. Really? You think so? What, don't think you're any good? A little self-criticism is useful. But believing in what you've got, that's much more important. A real rocker boy. Doubt that'll be me, ever. Come on, have faith. I just don't say things I don't think are true. Not anymore. Best day ever. Fuck! My hands are shaking. Rockers are rebels. They always speak their minds. Tried once with my dad, you know. Didn't go so well. In time, you'll learn who you really are. What you really want from the world. I don't understand. Wanna be a real rebel? Gotta be yourself first. Be authentic. Rebels are made, not born. Made from the punches life throws at them. The punches they take. You know, you're weird. But I like you anyway. Let's pay. Delta out of here. to see she'll be in good hands. Like you anything else? No, thanks. There you go. See ya. Let's Delta. Still got some bigs to do. Alright. Sure thing. Where to? The cemetery. You got it. That was perilous future for you this fine afternoon. And speaking of perilous times, this just in. Arisaka Corp has broken off negotiations with rival Militech. And that's right, boys and girls. We have it from anonymous sources that Yori Nobu and Arisaka said today, and I quote, all possible peaceful means of resolving the conflict have been exhausted. says there's gonna be another cold war liable to jump at each other's throats any day now think it's true think there'll be another war asking the wrong guy got no interest in the topic couldn't care less to be honest know why 
Why? Because I realized I don't have to. I've got a friend who lives around here. Where? Can't see it from here. Just saying. He a good friend of yours? He invited me over to his house once. His mom made lunch. Then we went and hung out on the bridge. I like driving through here. It's nice. out here. Never been out this way? No, I have. Just never noticed. Never had time to just sit down and watch. The city slipped through my fingers. Just sped right by. Passed underfoot, overhead. I can't even say when it happened. You wanna write a song about it? Maybe. Whoa! I didn't know you had a gun. Hella preen. Dad used to sell ones like those. You gonna shoot someone? No, it's just a keepsake. Um, belong to someone important, right? Hmm. Important doesn't even come close. What are you gonna do with it? Put it back where it belongs. I come with? No, wait here, okay? Won't be long. Okay. Can't carry this around anymore, you know. Can't keep wallowing. Can't keep obsessing over what happened. Couldn't forget you anyway. I'm wearing your goddamn face. Thanks for... Well, for everything. I can't believe it turned out this way. You'd still be queen of the afterlife if not for me. Although, I'm sure you'd say we finally got him good, huh? Yeah, we fucking got him. I shouldn't have dragged you into this. I'm sorry. now and I don't plan to waste it so this is goodbye Where to now? Hey, hey, what's this? Want one? Give all that up. So should you. Bad for your body. Bad for your soul. Where to now? I got a bus to catch. The person you just, uh, visited. He died a while ago? She. And not that long ago. You miss her? A little, yeah. When my grandpa died, I missed him a lot. But now I only miss him sometimes. Hmm.
the bus! Hey! Get off! Wait! The guitar! You forgot your guitar! No, I didn't. Haven't forgotten a thing. Never will. I know you're a free bird and all. You're gonna do what you want, when you want. But you could at least let me know you're alive, you know? I, I don't want to say anything, but you missed your last checkup. And like I told you a million times, uh, just call when you can, okay? See ya. De pendejadas. Straight to voicemail again? What's going on with you, eh? Lose your tongue or what? I know I wanted to tell you I'm, I'm cooking a supper on Sunday for Jackie's birthday. All his favorite food <laughs> chilaquiles, tamales. If I could get some real corn, oy, maybe even a lote. <laughs> It'd be nice if you could come over. Think about it. Cuídate, amorcito. Take care now. Pick up, pick up. I pick... Fuck. V, I, I don't know where we went wrong. Maybe uh, something happened or you needed to lay low. If you can, just give me some kind of signal that, that you're alive and everything's okay. Please. And if you ever need help, you know I'm here for you, right? Always. Stay safe. Call me when you hear this. Pleasant as usual. My cooler melted, it's 90 degrees in the shade, and there's sandstorms heading straight for us. So yeah, you're missing out. No, but seriously, we're doing all right. Saul and I somehow get along, for better or for worse. But still, family's always growing, work's always piling up. But better to keep busy, right? And to think, if it wasn't for you, I'd still be stumbling my way through Night City. So I just want to say thank you. For all you've done for me. I'd still be lost if you hadn't set me on the right track. All right, well, talk soon, V. Don't be a stranger. Hello, V. Um, Saul, so speaking. Heard about something big happening in Night City, with a certain B in the lead role. Uh, don't know what you plan to do now, but just remember, we always take care of our own. And, um, you're one of us now, V. You're an Alda Caldo. Remember that. Ah, uh, take care of yourself, V. 
and see you around. B, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raven ship. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, B. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now take care. Before samurai committed to seppuku, they wrote Jisei, a death poem. It contained their final thoughts about life, about death. I have read many of them of late, some were truly works of beauty. Yet, I am not a samurai, so I bid you farewell with simple words. Rot in hell, Kusama. Hey V, sorry to bother you, I know you're a busy woman and everything. But, well, I was wondering how you were doing, so I laid out a quick tarot and... Oh dear. The Hanged Man, the Magician, the Star. Those... those are not good cards, V. They're really bad. There's something like death, but... not quite. <laughs> 